Now, although not everything is going quite according to plan at the moment at the world's largest car maker, there are still one or two things to be cheerful about at Toyota, and this is certainly one of them. Welcome to the FT86 concept, otherwise known as the Toyo Baru, mainly because it's the result of a joint project between Toyota and Subaru. This is a traditional front-engined rear-drive coupe that's set to go on sale in 2012 for less than £20,000. And if it drives even half as good as it looks, well, I reckon we're all in for a right treat. So we're here with Yaramir Czech. Yes, that's correct. <laughs> yes. <laughs> One of the designers for the FT86. Um, just tell me a bit about the car. How long have you been involved with it? And how long has this project been in your mind? It's nearly two years. Yes. We started in uh, 2008, in mid-year, and basically finished by 2009 in October for the, well, August for Tokyo Motor Show in October. Basically, as a designer, we always try to make it exciting. But uh, I think just the basic brief was so exciting, you, can, well, you would have to make it really bad to mm. go wrong. You know? the, we heard, before actually we see the package or anything, we heard rumors from TMC or from Japan, they testing the chassis on a circuit and it goes like a go-kart. Actually, the whole design, the concept for the car was uh, functional beauty. And that, sh that says that we need to respect the function of the sports car essentials and uh, give it the, the, the beauty, the something that makes you think, oh, this is what I want. <laughs> the production should start to 2012, so maybe even before. This, as it says, is a concept. What can you see changing? What can you see being lost on the production car that's on this? I think the bonnet will have to go up, not because of the unfeasible engineering things. I think that's, you can put it in production like that, the exterior pretty much. It's from pedestrian. Pedestrian impact, yeah. Much. I mean, uh, basically, I heard that uh, Mr. Toyota really like it and he wants to push it very, very closely to production, mm. the exterior. The interior, I think uh, it's, uh, I, I would be very surprised if, <laughs> if there will be something left. Right. Basic idea was actually the same like exterior to emphasize the low center of gravity and emphasize the light, lightweight feeling. So, right. so you're deliberately going to be as low as possible? Yes, sit, yeah. sit create like dominant uh, center tunnel and really light uh, IP, no dashboard. Basically the dashboard idea was that to create trimming the urban ducting. And the idea of the zippers was to, not just the decoration, but for example, I, instead of creating plastic pockets, it just has a, you have like a jacket pocket. So you're taking away unnecessary plastics. And you think you'll, you'll do that in a production car? I don't see why not, but I think it's uh, maybe unconventional for Toyota. <laughs> What about what about back seats? Will there be will there basically just be no back seats? There will be. Space? Well, it should be two plus two, but uh, virtually for well, small I mean, is the intention to be able to seat uh, small adults? Small person, right. yeah. Okay. yeah. A bit like a 911. Yeah, I guess. We work a little bit on the concept with uh, PlayStation. Yeah. It's a little bit, uh, yeah, again, fun. engaging, uh, yeah. have a fun car. And of course, when you go to production, maybe this will be the GPS navigation things. That was the whole idea as well, to try to concentrate on the information in front of you, even with a production car. That to yeah, so you don't you don't have to look up down. Uh, yeah, everything's just, everything just is there, right everything there. Needs, yeah, yeah, it looks it looks really neat. And this is just a normal normal six speed gearbox. Yeah, averaging. you have uh, yeah reverse. You won't have anything fancy. No, because that that even the handbrake that was actually the whole intention that it's designed in spirit of. The old Colora, Col Col Corolla, sure. yeah. So you can go drifting. <laughs> <laughs> That's great, I love it. I think it looks absolutely fantastic. It looks as good inside as it does outside. So, production in 2012. next year or 2012? Yeah, yeah. So two more years. And you can confirm that? Yes, I could give you probably my left hand on it. <laughs> great, thank you very much Thank you for showing me around this car. It's great, I'm excited.